Hey everyone, it's been a minute since I've uploaded to the channel, and uh, I guess I'm sorry. <laughs> not really though, but I'd like to further explain on this video I uploaded not too long ago. This video, well, it's uh, very creative, and it may just look like someone spliced clips together and threw it out there on YouTube. However, this is actual in-game footage of me showcasing my script. Uh, this is... Well, a small part of the script, this is actually an easter egg of the script, I just wanted to throw it out there because I thought no one would use my script, and I can't really prove people haven't, but I'd like to shed more light on this script and give it a proper introduction to people that may be interested. Now I know that not everyone is in my Discord server, and you don't have to be to still enjoy the game and maybe mod it. But I would like to further elaborate on my script and say it's purely to stop people from going out of bounds. That's all it is. It's 2 Fort exclusive. I may touch up on other maps later. And I have heard that there is stuff for uh, Dust Bowl, which I may make my own version, uh, considering the one that I think people use is private. But I would like to say that, yes, my script is available to the public, has been for a while, and just hasn't had proper introduction. Now, of course, I'm going to provide some clips here and show that it does do its job. I'll show a general showcase of where the actual spots are that can get you teleported back. But besides that, it's just a script that teleports you back in bounds. There is nothing else to it except that small creepy room and putting people back into the actual bounds of the game. I'm not sure why a lot of people would use it, but if you're someone who prefers people don't go out of bounds and you have a modded console and you know how to mod this game, uh, you're more than welcome to use my script. Of course I'd prefer you mention that I made it and you didn't make it, but besides that there's no promotional material needed to actually say that I did make it. I just like the idea that, you know, people would like to use my work out there. Now before I actually get on to showing any clips of the script actually working in game or showing any of the spots that were patched, I would like to say that I did lie a little in the beginning. It, it was for a good reason though, I just didn't care enough to mention it. Now to actually get on with explaining my lie, I would like to say that this script actually isn't just an easter egg and just an anti out of bounds script. What it actually includes besides that is, well, bug fixes. Not really bug fixes, but fixing things that were forgotten to be put into the map, or forgot to be stretched to a certain length. Uh, I would like to start by showing that the blue spawn room, the, with the block to the spawn room, has actually been fixed. I did expand the length of the block a little further, so now people can't crouch past that little corner and get in the blue spawn room. And I would also like to say that this jumpy hole right here that soldiers and demos would go through and sometime engineers has actually been patched. I did create a block for it that never actually was put into the map. Now to get started with actually showcasing where the script fixes what, I would like to actually show this footage of what happens when you actually do get out of bounds, or at least attempt to. Now, it may not be very clean, but it is the solution as of now. I'll touch up later on what my plans are later if I ever do get back to this script and decide to improve it a little. As you can see right here in the clip, I build my dispenser, get up on top of it, and I try crouch jumping in the red intelligence to get in the window area, which is absolutely pointless, but still an out of bounds spot. And as you can see here, it instantly teleports you back. There's almost no chance to build a teleporter, and even if you do, you will get teleported right back. Now, as you can see right there in the clip, I do get stuck in my dispenser, which I'll touch up later in the end on what my thoughts are and other solutions on how I could fix this from happening. Now, I'm just going to give you a quick little gallery walk of really where I did actually put these barriers to stop you from going out of bounds, or more of these teleport spots. And, well, I may have forgot one spot in the pictures, but I couldn't really think of it whenever I was looking for them. So I'm just going to put them right here on the screen right now. So right here we have the intelligence rooms and the stairwells all the way down to the intel room, including these little booths right here that have no point in really getting into but still get you out of bounds. And on top of that we have these two spots right here right in front of red spawn where you can glitch up there in the little cage 
and also get above the actual spawn. I'm not sure why you would want to, it's actually very hard to perform, but it still prevents you from getting out. And finally, I did fix these spots where you can crouch on these boxes and put teleporters in the spawns. And well, here's the good news about this spot. You can still get on the box, do whatever you want, but as soon as you get collided into the ceiling, you will get teleported back off the box. So as long as you don't get your head stuck in the ceiling, you should be fine and it won't teleport you off the box. Now, to address the issues I kept bringing up but not really elaborating on, first I would like to explain that, well, if you do understand how these things work, you may be a little worried and wondering if you can actually build out of bounds, and as I mentioned, yes you can. There is an entity, however, I'm looking into that I believe can actually stop you from building out of bounds, but I'm actually unsure if it's compatible with this version of the Source Engine. Now I also would like to address that, yes, this can technically be used as a portal to spots, and because you can't get out of bounds, you can't really stop them from doing this. Now while it is hard to get into these spots because these out of bounds clips do teleport you usually before you can actually build there, it is still possible and can be done. Now, my thoughts on this were, when I later on update the script, I would think of a way to actually do team-specific boxes. So, if you touched it and you were red, you would get teleported to the main red spawn. However, if you were on the blue team, you would get teleported back to the blue. It's just simpler, and it can't be used to make a portal exploit, really. But even though it can be used as a portal exploit, it still isn't hard to defend these areas since it doesn't really give that much of an advantage, except the intel, but you're left exposed once you teleport there. Now, if you made it this far, I'd like to thank you. It actually took a while to make this, and I'm a very lazy person. Getting motivation isn't very easy. But I'd like to remind you that the download for this is free. All you need is a modded console and to join my Discord. You don't have to stay in there, but the download is in the Discord. And if you'd like to have the sound effects working in-game, uh, you're gonna have to read the instructions. I will have to update them though, because they are a little hard to read and understand. So, I will update them eventually. So, I'd just like to thank you guys for watching the video, and have a good day.